starters as well in just a moment. Rosen with possession on the left wing, feeds it up to Amber Sony, up for three, got it! The eighth seeded Hopkinton Hillers took on fourth seeded Milford in the Central Division II sectional semifinals. Side, now Mafiori on the corner. Mafiori back up to Amber Sony. Finfrock calling for it along the left wing, launches three, got it! The Hillers got off to a 14 0 run to start the first quarter and ended up outscoring Milford 23 to 10 in the frame. Feeds it over to Cooper, along the right wing, now into Rosen. Rosen trying to work the defender, up and in! Another strong pivot move, unstoppable. Kiss it off the glass for the two. Four different Hillers hit threes in the first. Along the top of the perimeter, feeds it in to the interior, and then it's passed over to Keith from Finfrock, and he knocks down a three. Unbelievable, 23 to four Hillers. Milford struck back in the second quarter and hit a few threes of their own, including a pair from Ralph Franklin Jr. Milford outscored the Hillers 21 to 14 in the second. To the corner, now over to Cooper along the way, around the perimeter they go, Matt Fiori thought about a three. Finfrock kicks it back out to Ambersoni, now Cooper coming in from the right side, up to Ambersoni. Ambersoni over to the corner, Ned Dean for three, count it! Ned Dean coming off the bench, giving his team some offense. Big shot. That's the Hopkinton led at the halftime break, 37 to 31. Matt Fiori takes it up for the Hillers, along the near side. Coming down the lane, he'll take it back out to the right wing, up to Ambersoni. And now a pass over to Finfrock, he'll watch the three from the left wing, no good. Tip by Cooper over to Rosen, and Rosen puts it up and in. Great tip by Cooper, he created that opportunity for Rosen to get the book back. The third quarter was a back and forth battle. Early Milford foul trouble helped the Hillers net some points, but the Scarlet Hawks knocked down a few threes, outscoring Hopkinton 17-14 and it was a 51-48 to Hillers lead heading into the fourth. And he'll pass over to Weatherby along the right corner. Up top to Darling, drives up to the elbow, feeds Franklin Jr. up for the lane and he's blocked by Finfrock. What a tremendous block underneath by Finfrock. Mafiori back to Finfrock. Finfrock feeds it in, pass it to Federer over to Dean. Dean oh, is gonna oh, take it up and in. Throughout the fourth quarter, it remained a close game but the early foul trouble for Milford came back to haunt them. Feeds it up top to Weatherby. Weatherby back to Darling on the left corner, up for three. No, off the back iron it goes, tipped in the air, and it looked like it was simultaneous contact between Weatherby and Ambersoni, and the Hillers have it. Matt Fiore takes it up the far side. Along the short corner, kicks it out to Ambersoni. Ambersoni for three, got it! Oh, big three-pointer. Darling would have tied it at the other end. Ambersoni gives them a six-point lead with six minutes to go. Hopkinton missed several free throws, but ultimately netted 10 points from the line in the fourth. Despite a couple Milford turnovers, the Scarlet Hawks struggled from the field. Hopkinton outscored Milford in the fourth quarter, 15 to 11, and took the game 66 to 59. Rivals, they don't play each other much, but whenever they do, it certainly seems like they play each other every year. The intensity is just amazing at a Hopkinton Milford game. Darling takes it across midcourt, down the lane, up with the right hand, no good. And it's collected by Ned Dean, and that is going to do it. The Hopkinton Hillers are going to take down the Milford Scarlet Hawks by a final score of 66 to 59. The Hillers of Hopkinton are moving on to the sectional finals where they will battle Wayland at Worcester State University. That game will be Saturday night at 7 p.m. Hopkinton, Wayland, what a game between these two teams. The Milford Scarlet Hawks end their season with a record of 14 and eight, while the 12 and 10 Hillers advance on to battle Wayland in the Central Division II sectional finals at 7 p.m. on Saturday, March 7th from Worcester State University. In points scoring for the Hillers, Stephen Mafiori had 16 points, Tommy Ambersoni knocked down 12, Elon Rosen was the team leader with 17, Ned Dean pitched in with 10 points of his own, a great team effort by the Hopkinton Hillers, and they are moving on to the sectional finals.